Hello, hello. Welcome back. Welcome back, guys. How you doing? How you doing? Hello, Alyssa. Welcome. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Good evening, teacher. Hey, good evening. Good evening. How are you? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. All right. That's awesome. So we're going to do a little review. To get started, let's go ahead and take a look at this video. Can everybody hear? Welcome to Advanced Module 2. In Can our first topic, hear? we'll go over infinitive and gerund phrases. Can you hear? We yes, studied this before, but don't okay. worry. We'll explain it again so you feel comfortable with it. Let me know if you have any questions. It plus be plus adjective or noun plus infinitive phrase is often used to comment on behavior. These sentences can also be restated with gerund phrases. It's rude to ignore your conversation partner. It's a good idea to try out different topics. Ignoring your conversation partner is rude. Trying out different topics is a good idea. The word considered may also follow be in this kind of sentence. Is considered impolite to interrupt people. Interrupting people is considered impolite. These sentences can also include the phrase for plus person or pronoun. It's customary for the complementary to say nice things about others. Saying nice things about others is customary for the complementary. We will begin our explanation by reminding you that gerunds and infinitives are both verbals. In other words, verbals are words formed from a verb but functioning as a different part of a speech, usually a noun. Gerunds are formed adding an ing ending and infinitives are composed of to plus a verb. In the structure just presented above, it becomes the subject of the sentence in the infinitive phrase. And ignoring, trying out, interrupting and saying are gerunds acting as subjects as well. Notice there's no changing meaning. Look at the following chart. Read it and decide whether they are using infinitive or gerund phrases. Okay. Now, I would like for us to discuss the questions that I just shared with everybody on the chat. Uh, listen and repeat. Are you happier now than you were a year ago? And you happy I were Are a you term. happy now than you were a year ago? Do you agree with the following? The more expensive, the better quality. 
Do you agree? Do you agree? The following. Do you agree? The following. The more expensive. The following. The, the more, more expensive. The better quality. The more expensive. Do you think vegetarianism is healthier than eating meat? Do you think Do you think vegetarianism is healthier than yeah. eating meat? Yeah. meat? Is it better to be poor and happy or to be rich and unhappy? Yes. It is better to be is it better poor to be poor and happy, and happy or, or to be rich, rich and rich unhappy? And one happy. Why happy. is lying sometimes easier than telling the truth? Why is, lying, why is sometimes lying sometimes easier than telling, the truth? And telling the truth? What would be more difficult for you? To what spend the night to spend a night alone in the woods or to give a speech in front of hundreds of people. What, what would be more difficult, difficult for you to spend a night alone in the world or to give, or to give a, a speech in front of hundreds of people? Okay, repeat please. Woods. 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 El bosque. Woods. All right, the next question. Does educated always mean more intelligent? Does, Does ed educated, educated, educated always, always mean more, more, intelligent? more intelligent? What is more dangerous, boxing or skiing? What, what is more boring? dangerous? What is boxing more dangerous? Or or skiing? Skiing? Are teenagers lazier than they were 20 years ago? Are, Are teenagers lazier than they were 20 years ago? No, two 20, years ago, 20 no, 20 years ago. No, 20, years, ago. No, 20 ago. years, yes, 20 years ago. Okay. Uh, what job is more demanding? A nurse or an engineer? What job is more demanding? A nurse or an engineer? An engineer. Okay. Uh, let me have one volunteer. One volunteer. Who wants to be my volunteer? Only one. Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, Gloria, go ahead, select one question. Ask me the question. Does educated always mean more intelligent? Not, uh, not necessarily. Not necessarily. Uh, I don't think that... Uh, more educated always means more intelligent. Uh, why Why do I say that? I say that because, you know, sometimes you have people that are not educated. Let me give you an example. Do you know who is Carlos Slim? Yes. Okay. So Carlos Slim is a multi-millionaire, billionaire, I think, nowadays. I think he's a billionaire. He's like the richest guy in Mexico or something like that, or the richest Latino in the world or something like that. But he didn't even finish high school. I think that he has like a third grade education. He used to sell newspapers in Mexico. Okay. So, right. What does that tell me? That tells me that even people that are educated are not intelligent. And then you have other people that have a master's degree, a doctorate degree, 
and they are not so intelligent, right? They're they're financially struggling. They're in difficult uh, situation in their life. They are in debt, you know. So it goes to show you that not always is more educated, more intelligent, right? Sometimes common sense uh, it's better than a formal education. Thank you, Gloria. Uh, give me another question, please, Gloria. What would be more difficult for you, to spend a night alone in the woods or to give a speech in front of hundreds of people? Uh, honestly, I think that probably would be more difficult for me to not give a speech in front of uh, hundreds of people because I'm not very camera shy. I'm not very microphone shy. I'm not very stage shy, right? I'm a very extroverted type of guy. I'm very outgoing. It's I'm not scared to talk in front of people. I'm not scared to talk to people I don't know. So I think that I, I'm not going to say uh, staying in the woods, spending the night alone in the woods. I don't think I would be scared if, you know, I had a, a, a pistol or a gun, you know, protection, knife, machete, something like that. I wouldn't be scared. Um, but yeah, that's it does sound scary, right, to be all by yourself in the woods, surrounded by darkness. Uh, one time I went to, I don't know if you're familiar with uh, the cabins that they have over there in El Boqueron. Are you familiar with those cabins? Huh? Yes, teacher, yes. <laughs> Okay, so one time I was renting uh, a cabin over there and it was night. It was like maybe one o'clock and we were doing like a bonfire and it was quiet and we can hear noises like noises to the right, noises in front of us, noises to the side. And there was a little moment that, yeah, it, it got a little spooky. It did get a little scary. I did get a little nervous, but I had my machete with me. So, you know, I was ready for anything. <laughs> but I, I did get a little nervous. Okay, one more question, Gloria. The last question. Okay. Do you think vegetarianism is healthier than eating meat? Honestly, I don't think so. Um, I think that when the human being is happy, he is healthy, right? If you are doing things that you enjoy, if you are enjoying your life, you're, you got good vibes, you're in a good mood, you're doing things right, you're trying your best, you're going for your goals, you're preparing yourself, you're planning, you know, and you, you have your dreams and you're working to achieve those dreams and to obtain your dreams and have your dreams. You know, I, I really don't think it matters if you eat a hamburger or a salad, right? I think all of this talk about diet, this diet, that, and healthy food and vegetarian and meat eater and all this and that, I think it's a whole bunch of psychological, unnecessary uh, stuff, you know, because I think that the human being, as long as you're happy and you're enjoying yourself, you're going to be healthy no matter what. So I think it has a lot to do with the psychology, not just the food. Okay, um, any questions at this moment about these questions? Any questions at this moment about these questions? 
Does anybody have any questions about these questions? Okay. I would like for you to work in pairs and one student ask the question and the other student responds to the questions and then vice versa. One student asks the questions and the other student responds to the questions and then vice versa. Ready? Let's go. So, who starts? Uh, first. And the premier is, are you happy? Mm -hmm. Are you happier now than you were a year ago? I think I was happier one year a year ago than I am now because um, I had five dogs, but this year two mm -hmm. of them died, and one of them was my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> he died uh, at Saturday and I'm a little bit sad but it's okay I'm fine mm -hmm. uh, it happens and what do you think about in my case, I am happier that a uh, year ago because uh, because I can say this. I'm, I'm thinking good. Things good. Etc. Okay. Next one. Yes. Do you agree with the following? The more expensive, the better quality. Quality. Mm, I disagree because uh, there are some brands that are expensive but they don't offer the best quality for example uh, when I compare butter and because I like to to bake I buy butter that doesn't contains salt so there are some brands like Danny mm -hmm. that I think is better for my recipes and this brand is not expensive it's cheap it's I am agreeing with you. Continue, please. Um, do you think vegetarian big home? What's what pronounce? Pronunciation? Vegetarian. Vegetarianism. Vegetarianism. Is healthier that 
y Meat. Mm, no. No. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, yes. Because in the food I chain, need it. we we used to eat meat. So we we, we get to, to we get to consume and uh, vegetables, fruits and and meat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we need it. Yes. Yeah. You think it's better to be poor and, poor and happy or to be rich and unhappy? Mm. It's difficult to answer, but I think that happy. maybe. I see what pair. For is uh, is per is dangerous, then. Yes. Um. My oh. okay. Question number one. Are you number one. Have a now. Have a cure. So. You can have all the money of the world, but you won't um, enjoy it because mm -hmm. you you prefer to be healthy and poor than to be sick and be rich. Conclusion. But I think that Somebody could feel happy if if this person would or would like to. Uh, is very happy is 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 for fourteen fourteen um for the things things por las cosas que he logrado. No sé cómo podría decir eso. No, ni yo. <risas> Pero es por eso, sí. Entonces, sí, es más, estoy más feliz este año. ¿En you? ¿En you, eh, Juan? In my case, uh, I think uh, every year has its experience. But for me, 2023 has been very good. Okay. That for me, I, I, aquí el teacher dijo que lo que quería decir se dice for me, achievements. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no for sé me? Cómo se Ahí en el chat lo puso. Uh -huh. Achievements. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, and question number two dice uh, is. Do you agree with the following? Which in front of the people? For me, it would be more difficult to spend a night alone in the woods because yeah. I, I right. <laughs> yes, I, I'm afraid of snakes, spiders, another <laughs> this. So in alone. Yes. No. No, and I I though I will not survive to with the nature. <laughs> I try and speak in front of hundred people. <laughs> 
No, I prefer to to give a speech in front of people. Yes. No. <laughs> Does educate always mean more intelligent? Mm, no. Not. I not. No. I mean. No, because you, for example, you can know people that that the doesn't even know to to read, for example. But they know another things like um, cooking and ay cómo se pronuncia cómo se dice bañilería cómo se dice qué albañilería albañilería ah brickwork Or some offices mm -hmm. that that would help you. So there is another kind the of bañiles. intelligence. Are very more smart. Ah, bricklaying. Bricklaying. <laughs> it's incredible. Bricklaying. En, eh, yo creo que no va a gustar. Pero what is more dangerous boxing or skiing? For me the boxing. Or boxing. For me skiing. Because yes. you can broke your break your bones. All right, guys, let me have two volunteer, uh, Gloria and Erica. Gloria and Erica. Go ahead, Gloria, ask the questions, and Erica, respond. Okay. Are you happier now than you were a year ago? Uh, Erica, your microphone is on silence. Okay, I think Erica is probably having problems with the microphone. Uh, let's have uh, Gloria and Daisy. Gloria and Daisy. Go ahead, Gloria, ask the question. Daisy, respond to the question. Daisy, can you hear me? Okay, I think Daisy is probably working. Let's go with Damaris. Uh, Damaris, are you there? Okay, so I think Damaris is working. Uh, Saul, can you hear me? Okay, Saul is not there either. Arsenio, can you hear me? Sorry, teacher, I didn't can participate in this activity because I of the work. Okay, you're working. Okay, got it, got it. Thank you, Arsenio. Uh, Juan Eduardo, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you. Okay, so let's do Juan Eduardo and Gloria. Juan Eduardo, uh, Gloria is going to ask you the questions, and I want you to respond. Okay. Okay. Are you happier now than you were a year ago? Um, I think is uh, every year has its experience uh, but for me 
2023 uh, has been very good. For example, um, in my job is uh, more uh, experience. Mm -hmm. uh, and um, uh, solamente. <laughs> ya no okay. sé qué van a decir. <laughs> excellent, excellent. So 2023 has given you good experiences. That's great. I'm happy to hear that. Uh, go ahead, Juan, select one question and ask it to Gloria. And Gloria, go ahead and respond to the question. Um, the, the question number two. Okay. Do okay. you agree with the following? The more expensive, the better quality. I disagree because there are some brands that are cheap, cheaper, 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 cheaper. and are good. Mm -hmm. For example, I like to bake mm -hmm. and I used to buy butter. Mm -hmm. And for example, this brand, Danny. Mm -hmm. I think is cheaper than another brand, mm -hmm. but it's a good quality and uh, it has a good taste for my recipes. Really? And so, uh, what, what do you enjoy baking? What recipes do you like to bake? Uh, for example, cupcakes or croissants. <laughs> okay. Another and one. apple do pie. It? Oh, nice apple pie. And do you do it just for like home consumption, or do you guys like have a bakery or a business or something like that? Well, I I bake uh, for my family, but sometimes I go to the town and sell some cupcakes okay nice awesome that's great all right very good hey go ahead gloria select another question and ask juan respond gloria select another question and juan respond okay is it better to be poor and happy or to be rich and unhappy Juan Eduardo, did you hear the question? It's very difficult answer. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, tricky. It's, it's a tricky question. Is, <laughs> is the money is very important, <laughs> mm -hmm. but uh, uh, but is are happy is more important. Okay, so you think being happy is more important than being rich? Yes, yes. Why? <laughs> um, um, because is uh, the money by uh, no no boy is uh, la salud. ¿Cómo se podría decir? Health, good health. Health, good the health. Money, the money not by good health. Okay. Yes, a teacher. Okay, okay. All right, guys. Now we are going to discuss um, other questions. I'm going to share with you some other questions. Okay, listen and repeat. Which job 
is the most gratifying? Which job is the most gratifying? Which job is the most gratifying? Which, Which job, job is the most is the gratifying? gratifying? Describe the best holiday you've ever had. Describe, Describe the best the holiday, holiday you've, you've ever had. What is the most surprising thing that has ever happened to you? What is, what is the, what most, is the most surprising thing that has ever happened to you? you? What's the most difficult decision you've had to make? What the most what is the most difficult decision you had to make? When did you feel the proudest? When do you feel when the did you feel the proudest? What is the craziest thing that has ever happened to you? What is, what is the greatest, greatest, greatest thing, thing, thing that, that has that ever happened to you? Happened to you. Ever happened happening to you. Describe the most delicious dish you've ever eaten. Describe, describe the most, describe the most delicious dish you, you've you ever eaten. eaten. Who is the smartest person you know? Who is who the smartest, is, who person, is the smartest you know? person you know? Who inspires you the most? Who inspires, who inspires you the most? Uh, what is the weirdest present you've got? What, what is, is, what is the, the weirdest, weirdest present you've got? But you've got. <laughs> you've got. But, All right. But, I would but. like for you to ask the questions and then we will discuss it together as a class. Ready? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Hello, Sandra. Hello, Gloria. Good evening. Good evening. So, who asks? Uh, it doesn't matter. You can take turns. It doesn't matter who goes first. Okay. So, the first one, which job is the most gratifying? <laughs> okay, uh, the question I see, uh, let me check the WhatsApp, the group, the WhatsApp check. Uh, Yo vi que lo puse en el chat de la plataforma. Ah, en el chat, ¿verdad? Ok, ahorita. No, pero ya lo puse en el chat también del... De, de, del grupo, de, ¿verdad? Ok. Eh, I see question... Is the question more difficult que las anteriores? <laughs> yes. <laughs> with yours. With, with number one is with... Which yo is the most gratifying. Que si tu trabajo es más gratificante, quiere decir algo así. Eh, que cuál trabajo, que, 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 como que, que trabajo es más gratificante. Ok. Um, I respond. You. My answer oh, yeah. is the job more gratifying is a, a doctor. Uh, because it's safe life. 
uh, and help many people. Mm -hmm. um, in my case, job is most gratifying are, are the prof uh, I agree, I agree the todas las profesiones or all, all, all agree or all, all profession. Our profession um, is necessary um, for, um, for example, in, in, in health, um, in construction, construction, construction or building, building, uh, in uh, uh, construction, building, um, and medic, or uh, hospital. Uh, doctors and uh, nurse in uh, for me all 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 profession is important yes it's true it's true mm -hmm. okay Juan the question uh, number two describe the best life? Holiday you ever have? Que describa lo mejor de la. ¿Qué ¿Cómo que describa? cuentes las mejores vacaciones que has tenido? Oh, ok. Responding respond you, uh, Juan, please, first. Um, my best vacation uh, maybe is um, travel. Travel Belize. Okay. It is um, the experience the uh, bucear. Ah, good. It's great. Sorry, what's this? Books in this Booksing, dice aquí. <laughs> ah, okay. Books in. Mm -hmm. Books in. Aha, tu, tu, tu esa experiencia. Okay. For me, it's the best vacation. The best holidays. holidays. Uh, okay. In my case, it, the best holiday you, is vacation in, in 2019 and travel the USA um, on my own in Austin, Texas. Uh, for... 14, day, 14 days is um, eh, eh, con, como decir conocí, no sé cómo se dice conocí. Conocer o... Sí, sí, vi puede decir, Ajá, como que looking, viste. Oh, looking, vi... Um, and the tourists, um, the tourists and the Alamo, and it's um, is this beautiful um restaurant and uh, good food and um only that. This is my whole is my my. Uh, best holiday, holiday vacation. Yeah. Are you have visa in your pass? Yes, I I have visa uh, the pass passport pass. Mm -hmm. Okay. Enjoy the day and eat everything. <laughs> Which beach did you visit? Okay. What is the most surprising thing that has ever happened to you? Mm. 
the moment not remember. Okay. In my case, forget. In my case, uh, I don't know, uh, maybe it's, um, it's, uh, you, uh, you're, you go, you go to the Belize, Belize in, in fly or, or, or in bus? In bus. In ah, bus. okay. It's bad experience. Okay. Oof. Is what, very, what, very... what days is what what days uh, cuánto tiempo to go it go days cuánto tiempo te tardas en ir algo así no sé cómo decir pero eso te estoy preguntando um maybe twenty hours ah oh, twenty hours yes, oh, one day uh, no casi un día casi un día veinte veinte horas but uh, means, uh como hacíamos paradas y no sé in the car in the car you, you cars o o o, o así en, como en bus a, a parte is the bus is the bus oh, okay y cuántos días fue, fuiste what did, what day cuánto one what? week okay good it's, it's beautiful Yes, yes, is uh, but he speak English. Oh, in, pero, but, but. And I, and I decide for a study in the, my career for a longer. And it was difficult for me to decide for both, I don't know, but I prefer to study for a longer because I like only that. Yes, it's better to enjoy the career. Yeah. I was the same way. I, I, did I couldn't decide I didn't know to decide which career to study but at least I choose architecture and you Alisa in my case um, uh, I he was working in the San Salvador. I, I was difficult for me to leave my job because I have the take with her, take, take care. care. Take care of my son. And I... I was difficult for me. Okay. When did you feel the proudest? Quiero ver, quiero ver. 13 años. Eh, ah, eso te lo pregunto. Ah, eso te lo pregunto. Sí, es. Are they... Eh, 13, se dice 13, 13. Sí, 13. Year, 13, year old. Está, está eh, en el edad. Eh, de, de, de la rebeldía. Sí, no, <risa> son tranquilos, fíjate. Son bien, 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 tranquilos. Son unos gemelos que tengo... Tienen so 13 only, años. Only son. Ah, only son. Mom. Yeah, no, only. Yes. Is, That's it, Juan. Is, is search the, 
the oh, yeah, yeah. the girl. No, 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 and... no, <laughs> no, yeah, no. It's the it's the it's the, it's the, it's the clouds the far the the fabric. <laughs> oh, <laughs> ya cerramos la fábrica. <laughs> sí. Okay, Juan. Um, thank you, Juan. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Okay, good night, Juan. Right, let me have one volunteer. One volunteer, please. Two volunteers. Go ahead, Carlos and Juan. Carlos and Juan. Okay, teacher. Um, I have a question or respond, teacher. Yes, Carlos, ask the questions. Ah, uh, okay. Juan, respond to the question. Okay, uh, Carlos. Okay, Juan. Uh, the question. Uh, uh, number two. Describe the be the best holiday you ever had. Okay. Um, I think the best holiday for me is travel. Belize, Belize. Um, um, so good experience. Um, for example, I visit um uh, the beach. Is okay. um, uh, so beautiful. Okay, Juan. Well. Thank you, Juan. All right. Now, Juan asked the question. Carlos, respond. Okay. The question number one. Which job is the most graffiti? Okay. Um, for me, is in um, all profession, uh, this must... Uh, uh, which you use? Uh, que si, uh, la pregunta es si cuál es, eh, perdón Juan, me lo puedes repetir. Eh, Juan, okay, can you repeat the question? The, the question number one, which job is the most graffiti? Eh, que qué es lo más gratificante de mi trabajo, ¿verdad? Algo así, ¿no? No, no. en su opinión, ¿qué trabajo es el más gratificante? Ah, oh, ok, teacher, sorry. Mm -hmm. eh, yo, pues, en mi my case, uh, our job most graphing is our profession, teacher, no, no, uh, no, but but important uh, import and import import uh, the Important. the job. What is it? Uh, important. Yes, important. Uh, did our profession teacher no no. Uh, Oh, for sorry, Juan, uh, is job 
or graphics, graphic, graphing, gratifying, gratifying. Yes, teacher. Only that. Okay. Thank you. Go ahead. Ask the next question, Carlos and Juan. Respond. Okay. Um, no, the question number one. Number nine, who inspires you the most? Okay. Um, I I think is uh most experience for me is read reading the Bible uh, is is uh interesting for me mm -hmm. it is 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 only excellent okay. go ahead juan the next question carlos respond okay uh, the question number 10 what is the weirdest present you got? What is the weirdest present you've got? Question. Weirdest. Okay. Um, I don't know. Weirdest, teach, weirdest teacher? Hey, weirdest is como que el más raro. El más raro. Uh, ¿Y qué, qué, qué es lo más raro que... Me ha pasado algo así, quiere decir eso. La pregunta. No, que, que le han dado como regalo. Ah, ok. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's difficult, teacher. Uh, no. No. Uh, where is this uh, uh, present? Mm -hmm. No. Is. All beautiful, the, the present teacher. <laughs> okay, okay, that's great. And your that face, teacher. Uh, in my case, maybe glow in the dark socks. <laughs> Calcetines que brillan en la oscuridad. That was weird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, what is this? Glow in the dark socks. I'm like, okay. Okay, okay that, teacher. That's a little weird. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and uh, stop right here. We got to get ready for the next class. At this moment, does anybody have any questions about these questions? Questions about these questions. It's difficult, teacher, to speak <laughs> in English. <laughs> yeah, but if you if you don't practice, then you will never. Yes. The most, the most uh, vocabulary, um, 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 birds, birds, um, the structure, uh, muchas cosas. <laughs> yeah, the verbs, the prepositions, yes, the auxiliaries. Okay, teacher. Okay, all right, guys. I, I guess good night. Go. <laughs> yeah, you got to okay, study. Okay, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, guys. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Bye. Bye. -bye.